When student lockers are abandoned, the treasures within are put up for auction. This is the wild factor. I'm not intimidated by any buyers. Cash is king, winner takes all. You don't know what you're going to win. Where's that old man Barry at? <laughs> oh, there he is. All right, folks, welcome to Whitley County Consolidated Schools. These are the rules of locker auctions. This is a cash only sale. All sales are final. We're going to cut the lock. We're going to open the door. You're going to have five minutes to look. You cannot go inside the unit. You cannot open up any boxes. We're going to sell the locker to the bidder with the most cash in his pockets. Are you ready to go? Let's go. All right, folks, who's ready to spend some money? Okay, big guy, cut the lock. Why? You're welcome to come work out with me sometime. Okay, folks, we got ourselves a nice locker here full of all kinds of goodies for you. Shall we start the bidding out, folks, at $100? Here we go. Do I have a bid at $100? Yep, I got a bid at $100. Now we're at $200. Over there's $200. $250. You gotta give me $250. Give me $250. I'm at a $300 bid. Well, we got a $300. I'm at a $350. Three fifty going once. Yeah. Nope. Now we got a three fifty. How about a four hundred? Yeah. There's a four hundred over there. Four fifty. Yes, four fifty. Do we have five hundred dollars? Five hundred dollars. Yeah. Yep. Over there's five hundred. Five hundred dollars going once. Five hundred dollars going twice. Sold. Five hundred dollars. Yeah. Pay the lady. Okay, big guy, you think you can uh, cut the lock this time? I think I got this one now. You want to buy two tickets? To what? The gun show! 1382. Russ had left behind some wrestling gear. Who uh, who knows what else is in there? <laughs> well, let's sell uh, locker 1382, folks. We're going to start the bidding out at $10. Do I have an open bid of $10? Right here. Now I got a bid of $10. How about a 50? I got to have a 50. Yep. There's a $50 bid. How about a bid of $100? $100. Now 100 Right here. How about 200 Do we have a $200 bid? There's a $200 yep. bid. This is a great locker, folks. How about $300? $300 down to $300. Yep, gotta give yeah. me $350. $350, $350. Yeah. That's a $350. How about $400? $400, $400, $400. Got it. $410. Right. $410. $410. Gotta give me $410. Do I have $410? No. Come on, folks. There's lots of good stuff in here. $410. $400 going once. $400 going twice. Sold your way. $400. Yeah! yeah. Before this next auction hit, I'm going to check my booty over here because I think I got some good stuff in here. Check it out. Oh. Uh, maybe a pocket calculator, 20 bucks. Not sure what that goes to. It's damaged. So we got a nice ostrich looking guy. Oh boy. This one's kind of in pieces. I'll patch that up. Oh, that could be trouble. Could be trouble. That looks crazy. 
Smells like uh, ship Shawana over here. Woo Let's get this stuff checked out, baby. Okay, now, big guy, this is your final chance. You got this? I think so. They call me Mighty Mouse at Gold's Gym. That's how it's done. Okay, folks, we got our final locker of the day. 1449 is your lucky number. Uh, you might be able to find some kind of treasure in this locker. Do I have an opening bet of $5? There's a bet of $5. How about a bet of $25? $25 over here. Do I have a bet of $30? Nope. $25 going once. $25 going twice. Sold your way. Sandy, I, uh, I got this stuff out of a locker. I know you're an expert on a lot of things. I just want an estimated value. I, I think I might have struck gold here. Okay. That's some kind of camera. Oh, wow. That's a Pentax. A K1000. Ooh. I think they made these 1948, 49. Okay. And I know Columbia City High School is still using these. Oh, So this wow. is probably That's worth it. 21st century skills, isn't it? It is. It is. Awesome. Uh, yeah. I mean, this is the original take a picture black and white problem. Wow. Okay. What, uh, how many do you think it's worth? How much? Oh, well, maybe 25 bucks. 25 bucks. You happy with that? No, it's not bad. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. I got a couple other All right. things here. All right. Uh, let's see. I got, uh, I got this guy. Uh, it looked like he had a switch on the side. Oh, I didn't want to wow. try it. I didn't want to break it. I was kind of worried. Flying pig. Pig, okay. Pigs can fly. Let's see. Is, is it still working? You think? Uh -huh. Oh, well, look uh, at that. Well, would you look at it? <laughs> well, look at that. Uh, but you know what? Uh oh, there's a screw missing. The bottom's ah. falling out. I don't know, maybe 10 bucks. $10? 10, $10. Bucks. I paid good money for this locker. Uh, I don't know. That's a tough one. Okay, all right, all right. Got another one. Okay. Now, this one this one here is kind of hard to hold. Ooh. A little furry. Oh. I like what I'm hearing already. Wow. This is the original dancing ostrich. Oh, My goodness, this okay. is a Hollywood era type thing. I really? believe this was made like in the. Look at where it. do you see that? Oh, there's a switch. Yeah, let's see if oh, it still yeah. works. I think there's, there's something here, maybe. Oh, well, there it goes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, you that's got to be worth yeah. big bucks. This is, this is worth good well, money. I would say maybe about 50 bucks. 50? But if you had the box, yeah. a grand. Easy. Easy a thousand dollars? You gotta have the box. Oh, I don't get the you gotta box. Gotta have the box, baby. Well, go back and look in the locker. All Maybe right. it's in the next. I locker. got a moped. I will gas her up and I'll go check. All right, good deal. This other thing's a little stinky, but I thought okay. I might have some hidden work. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a no minute. No good. That's no good. If it's wet and it's not yours, you better not touch it. Let oh, me get some boy. gloves and get that out of your hands because. Kind of squishy. That, yeah, it is squishy and it's yucky and I don't know. I, don't I bet know it smells real bad. Yeah, don't you don't know how long it's been in there, do you? Oh, uh, I don't know. It's been in the. Oh, that's oh, bread. Oh, no, 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 no. This, uh, that's uh, real bad. Nope. As a matter of fact, it's not worth holding on to. Oh. I don't know. I'm so going to pinch it the right way. Yep. And look, you got to make sure you wear gloves. That's worth negative dollars, isn't negative. it? Negative, yes. Oh, yes. boy. Cost I need gloves COVID. or something. Yes. You oh. should. You need to wash your hands I'm going to wash my hands as soon as I get out of here. You need to wash your hands. Okay. All oh, right. Boy. Well, good job. Hey, thank you very hope much. You find that box. I sure hope so. Okay. I'm going to get my little head and get on out of here. All right. Thank you very much. Good deal. All right. I'm gonna go see how Dave did on his locker. Okay, okay, go. Did you get some good stuff in your locker? Yep. Is that a Billy Bass? Yep. Is that a golf club? Yep. Stuck in a bag of something nasty? Yep. <laughs> Don't you think you better ask the nurse if you can even touch that? Yep. Oh. Well, hello, Dave. Looks like you're
you've been cleaning out some lockers. Yep. You got some good stuff for me? Yep. Yep. Um, well, what it looks like a big mouth Billy Bass. Yep. Yep, haven't seen these in a while. It's, uh, it's, uh, looks pretty dusty. Yep. Yep. Um, looks like it's just kind of plastic. It's in good shape for plastic. It's, yep. uh, it's got some rubber on it. That's good. Um, well, I, I don't know what to tell you about this. It's just not probably very valuable. I'm guessing maybe, oh, I don't know, 50 cents a dollar? It's, it's just, wait, hey, does it have batteries in it? Yeah. Do they work? Yeah. Hey, you just doubled your money. I'd say probably a good two, three dollars for Big Mouth Billy Bass. Yep. Got anything else for me? Yep. Oh, what in the... You found that in a locker? Yep. Let me guess, a senior locker? Yep. Oh, it is wet. It is not mine. Um, did you touch this? Yep. Oh, oh. yep. <laughs> um, um, did you have gloves on? Mm, yep. Oh, um, well, the club looks good, but before I take it out to take a look at it, I, I'm going to have to put gloves on. That is, yep. that is some nasty stuff. Anytime it's wet and it's not, not mine, gloves. Okay. Well, let me take this out here. Whoa. That is chunky. And wet. Yep. 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 And you found this in a locker. Yep. Yep. Well, um, the club looks like it's in pretty good shape. It's, it's kind of a vintage club for, for as far as that goes. It looks like it's uh, oh probably worth a good three four dollars. Um, the important thing though is that we get rid of this whatever this is that it came in. Yep. Um, gonna dispose of that. Take these gloves off and wash my hands really good. I think that might be some good advice for you as well. Yep. Okay. All right, we're going to have to check out what Brandy overbid on again. No, wait. I, I'm always worried about this. this. Brandy spent too much money. Jerry, you don't know what you're talking about. We we'll got. Check this. I don't know what this is. It looks good. No, oh, maybe maybe we can get our money back on these 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 these, these little props. Maybe maybe somebody would want those. I wish we had some more bigger stuff. Maybe it goes with this. Oh. I don't know what that is. Maybe that does go with that. That's maybe we'll have to get this looked at. Those are not, I wish you had two of them. Does this go with it? Huh? This right here. They match. Over they match. Oh, maybe. Did you say overpaid? Well, Brandy, you, you know, what's a plane? What's a plane look, with wings? Look, just wi the rest of it. Oh my it's gosh. In there. Yeah. It's all in there. It's all in there, Brandy. Is this, is this plane fuel? Maybe this is fuel to it, go with it. It could, think. Oh, it could think. be. It's a senior locker. Do you think it's fuel? Wait, this is, we're in the senior lockers? <laughs> yeah, we're in the senior lockers. This might be something bad. This, Should we be touching that? This is wet and it's not ours. We, we should touch. not have touched this. All right, we'll take in and get it appraised. <laughs> I'm going to put it back in here. All right, put it back in here for now. So I'm over here at Indian Springs to find out because I, I heard you know something about this stuff, Candy. Brandy and I went to a storage locker and I, and I found these. I, I think they might be worth some money. How much did you pay for your storage locker? $25. Well, if this is all you got in there, you're in trouble because these are only worth about a dollar a piece. Oh. They're just little propellers that go on. They look more like on a, um, you know, a paper airplane. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Did you, okay. Get, did you get anything else? We got some other stuff. I, okay. I got something I want to show you. I, I don't think the value is going to be like this, but I, I, I'll show you. I'll show you. Maybe this is worth some money. Oh, this is amazing. This is a miniature aircraft plane. Oh, you fly babies in them. No, not quite like oh, that. You no. use it for a remote, a remote control. Oh, plane. that's kind of nerdy. No, no, no. It's really cool. It's really cool. It's really it. a neat thing to do. Um, it, this is a giant scale yak. Um, it's made by Lanier. It's got an 87-inch wingspan. It's pretty wide. That's pretty good. It's got a 50cc DLE engine. Okay. Uh, digital servos. There's two servos on each control. Oh, service. I saw that. There's two of these mechanisms yep. down there on each wing. That's, that's cool. That. 
Um, they have removable wings, which makes it nice. We took those off to get them into Brandy Smart Car. There you go, there you go. Um, I only see one issue with this, though. Aww. There's no radio and there's no battery. Oh, so it's not it. worth anything? Oh, I wouldn't say that. It's it's actually a good price. Um, you could get it valued at $1,500. We paid twenty five for the locker. So, yeah, so you are you did a good deal. You oh, did a good deal. And, and how much is this worth? Um, that, I hope you didn't touch. It's, it's airplane fuel, right? No. Oh. No. Um, when you see something like that, you should always put your personal protective equipment uh, on. And then you handle it with gloves. Well, why glove? What, what, what? I mean, I because got a plastic you, barrier here. You cannot see blood in urine. Mm, not even with the glasses? Not even with the glasses. Oh, okay. Or um, if, if, they, if it's not urine and if it's something else and there's saliva in it, you can't see blood and saliva a lot of times either. Oh. So you always want to make sure that you're protected. Well, since you got glove on, you want to just throw it away? I will take care of that for you. All right. Now, how much do you want for this? Because I'm really interested in this. You would do something like this? I, I would. I would. Um, I'm interested. Well, you said 1500 Well, yeah, that that's would be value. But but I want you to cut me a good deal. So I'm, I'm thinking maybe 1200 Can you do 1250 Well, I still have one of my four in college. So can we go 1225 I think I can get my husband to go with that. Can I shake you that glove hand? Uh, here, I will remove them properly. So you don't touch them. There. All right. There we go. Can I get a check now? Sure, let's Brandy go. Brandy always wants me to bring the money the back. The money, went, I yeah. can understand that. Thank you. Jared and Brandy soared to first place in the bidding war thanks to Brandy's monstrous $25 investment. Daryl failed to buy a single locker, but also failed to lose a ton of money on worthless lockers. Barry could have scored big if he would have found that box for his dancing ostrich. And Dave Hester took a big hit when the batteries in his billy bass proved to be more than the billy bass himself. Hey, isn't that Barry's ostrich box? 